Welcome to Kendra's Artistic Crochet Designs. And I am your artistic crochet host, Kendra. Um, so uh, today, um, I know it's Yarny Thursday, but I'm going to show you something other than yarn today. <laughs> so we, um, I, had, I had got some new needles that I kind of want to show off. Let's see. Where's the other needle at? Well, there it is. Okay. So, um, Susan, Susan Bates had put these, these needles out. And I, I really like the Susan Bates hooks. But these are interchangeable. And... Inside here are the rest of the needles. Whoop, that just fell out of there. And so I think there is one, two, three, four, five, six different sizes of the needles. And then what you do, you interchange them. You just, they come out. And then on this end is a... It's a cutter and you put your yarn through there and it cuts cuts your yarn. That's pretty cool. So um it's 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 taken me a little bit of time to get used to it. Um but I do I do like the hook, but I um I still would rather have my other uh, dots hooks, you know. I just wanted to try these, but they work. Um, and then I have a friend, um, like I work over at the Bristol, and they were um, looking for some knitting needles. And so... I found these on Amazon as well. It's in a case. And so here's a whole thing of knitting needles. And you take and put them on these. So these, these just screw on and she really Love these. I um, this was the first week that we finally got them in, and like Amazon took took forever. Usually, I have Amazon like next day, but it took me forever to get these. And you just screw them in, screw them on, like that. And then there's there's a stopper at the end that you do the same. She really liked these because these were so much easier. She's making a, a blanket, a children, a child's blanket. And the other needles that she had wasn't long enough. And so she was having a rough time and hurting her hands. And this is so light that her hands are not hurting when she uses these. And um, she, um, she really likes these needles. So, there's those. And I got those on Amazon. I went shopping yesterday um, to Hobby Lobby. And I found some... I found some needles at Hobby Lobby. Two that I thought were really neat. I'm going to give these a try. I thought they were pretty. They're colorful. It just says uh, it's from Yarnology and it's the luxury crochet hook. Um, 
These were $3.29. These weren't expensive at all. And, yeah, it's um, they had them in all sizes. Yeah, it's called Yarnology Luxury Crochet Hook. Makes those. So, this is a six millimeter too. And this is my favorite hook, six millimeter. Um, I was going to give that a try. And also, there's a crochet um, hook case that I found there to hold my hooks. That comes off there. Well, there it is. All right, there's a button here where you could, it snaps down, but the hooks goes in here like this. I don't know. Those will be too big, um, but it they got their own case anyway. These are hook. This is for hooks. That I could set by my side here and I can also put some like other things in here like uh, stitch markers and stuff like that and then I'll have those in here um, needles like you know sewing needles and then I thought this would be a nice little case just to have by my side when I'm crocheting and then I have my hooks right at my fingertips. So there's that. All right, so what I want to do is I'm going to get a little bit of yarn here and I'm going to try this hook. And see. Let's see. How this hook fares. And it's um, they're very short hooks. They're not very long hooks. I mean, I, I can crochet with them pretty quick like I normally do, so. Which is very surprising because these are not metal at all. And I usually like my metal hooks. Let's try double crochets. The yarn isn't it's very smooth. I mean, for $3.79, hooks usually, some hooks are more expensive than that. That's not bad. <laughs> for $3.79 for per hook, that is not bad at all. That crochet is up really nice. So I have I just made a little swatch of some single crochets, half double crochets, and double crochets, just to see. And we'll do a let's do a row of trebles and see how the trebles go. There we 
we go. It's not bad. Nope. The hook kind of sets right in in here whenever I hold it. And it's got the er ergonomic so that, um, you know, um, it doesn't wear your hand out. If you have arthritis, ergonomic hooks are really nice. Um, and I really do love my ergonomic hooks since I do have some arthritis problems. So they had, see, that was the J hook. And let's see if I... I think they're all a little bit different. This one is a six and a half millimeter. So that's a K hook. And and then I got a five millimeter. I think it started out as five millimeter and went up. And um, the hooks, I think went all the way up to past a, a P hook. But I, I didn't get those because very rarely do I, I crochet with those huge hooks. Which I do have some in case I want to. Um, but um, these are the hooks that I use the most. So it's the five, the five and a half, the six, the six and a half. These are the hooks that I use most of the time on different things. But, well, there we go. So you see how the, they have a, a nice little end line to sort of like um, Susan Bates has the end line. A little bit and they're well you know pinks purples yellows blues <laughs> I mean those are some of my favorite colors so I just thought those were pretty anyway there you have it um, so until the next time I will see you and bye-bye um, now.